Well, for most of us, a Wi-Fi router, it's our connection to the world. But with everyone online in our homes, how's that going for you? Probably pretty slow. You would be right, Tracy. And today's Consumer Reports Better Call Harry shows you how to speed things up. If I get one more complaint around here about our Wi-Fi... I can't get into my class! I'm switching back to dial-up. What's dial-up? Option two, if you're willing to spend $150 or more, Wi-Fi 6. About a year ago, Wi-Fi 6 routers were kind of hard to find, but nowadays they're pretty much everywhere. So what is Wi-Fi 6? It's the latest version of the Wi-Fi networking standard. That's just some tech jargon, but here's what you really care about. It transfers data faster and it handles more data, more devices at the same time better than older Wi-Fi standards. That means faster and more stable connectivity. And Wi-Fi 6 routers are the first to have built-in support for WPA3, the latest wireless encryption standard, which makes it harder for hackers to access your private data. And you don't have to worry about compatibility issues with older devices because different generations of Wi-Fi are designed to communicate with each other. Because Wi-Fi 6 routers are more efficient, your older devices may see better performance. So are you ready? Consider the Netgear Nighthawk Mesh Network, a Consumer Reports Best Buy. It has automated firmware updating, and CR says it's easy to set up and does an excellent job of sending out a Wi-Fi signal. Since a lot of upcoming tech is expected to be Wi-Fi 6 certified, upgrading your router now is kind of like future-proofing your home network. And it just may stop the kids from complaining. I'm online! I'm Better Call Harry with your Consumer Reports. Harry, thank you. Henry.